Hi, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't watched before, my name is Tanil, and today, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm gonna do a quick unboxing of my BoxyCharm limited edition box. It literally just came in. I'm really bad about usually opening the box before I open it with you, but not today. The only thing I did was cut the little tab so we'd be ready to go. Please excuse the fact that I have undone hair as well as no makeup, but I'm going out this evening with my husband for a date night and I knew this was coming in today, so I was just waiting for it to get here so that way I can unbox it and then use some of the products tonight. So I'm so excited to see what colors I got because of course I already know everything that's in the box. So opening it up, we have the really cute pink foam that was special for the limited edition as well as the cool card that talks about all of the products on the other side of the box. Please excuse the noise, my dog is outside whining. So, oh, I knew I'd get that one. Here is what I got. Did we see that good? I didn't even look. Anyways, all right. Let's see. So let's go in and look at the Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops. And I got Halo, which, oh my gosh, I know this is like a sought after drop that a lot of people wanted. And so I'm kind of shocked that I ended up with this one because I feel like, I don't know. I just did not think this was what the one I was going to get because I know you could get this one or Blossom. So I got Halo. Wow. Kind of exciting. All right. Moving on, we have a Sigma tapered blending brush and I'm pretty excited ah, this is my first Sigma makeup brush so I'm really excited to give that a shot all right moving on we have the pure big look with argan oil mascara And then of course we have, uh, and I didn't realize this until recently, but this is actually not a full size product. This is technically a deluxe like sample size, um, but it's still a $50 value. So that's kind of crazy. And I'm sorry, I have not went over the prices of any of the products here, have I? I am so sorry. Let's go back really quick. So the cover FX is $42. That is just crazy. The um, mascara is 21. The tapered blending brush is 17 and then this which is an advanced vitamin C cream that says it's good for helping even skin tone promotes healthier younger skin um, it has 8% vitamin C and SPF 20 and anyways this is $50 and this is not even full size and this is $50 that's crazy um, next we have the bare minerals buttercream lip gloss in Gen new oh and popular I guess is the name of the color it is a very nude lip which oh I mean that's kind of pretty though actually I mean it's hard to say I don't do well in nude honestly it's not my favorite okay I'm super excited to give this a shot. Now this I know is definitely not a full size. It's a deluxe size, but you know, because of the type of primer that it is, it's not something you wanna use necessarily every day. Oops. And so I'm okay with that. This is the Becca First Light Priming Filter Primer. So I'm so excited to try that. Next, we have the Full Spectrum Eyeliner Pencil in Espresso. I was hoping for like the purple or something like that, but at the same time, I'm glad I didn't get black because quite honestly, I'm done with black. So, oh, that is creamy. So nice dark brown, I'm excited for that. I I'm glad I didn't get black, I have tons of black. So last but not least is the Tarte High Performance Minerals be your own Tartist eye and cheek palette. I was kind of hoping to get the one with more purple tones, although this is so pretty on the outside. And it's actually quite beautiful. It's quite pretty. 
I really need some purple eyeshadows in my collection, so I was kind of hoping for that. Um, I am really loving the blush. I must say I have two of the Amazonian Clay blushes, and they are my favorite. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, I really want to know the name of this blush color, but unfortunately I'm not sure what it's called. So... Um, I don't know if there's that. So that's everything that I got in my limited edition box, right? Yep. I'm really excited. Um, <clears throat> I was a little nervous about some of the products that I was going to get. So I was very curious to see what I got. This packaging is gorgeous. Just so pretty. So I'm excited to try them out. We'll see how it goes. Um, I know that people have not been giving the highest... Um, rave reviews but wow like that's actually not horrible and let's try that one you know what those are kind of pretty so maybe I'm a little more excited about this palette than I thought I was going to be after seeing some of the people that have gotten the other color so anyways, thank you so much for watching my channel. Um, this was a pretty quick little run through really quick of what I got in my limited edition BoxyCharm box. And um, I'm so excited that I actually got one. Really surprised that I was able to get it. I know a lot of people had a lot of issues and it took forever for it to ship. But I, I think I love it. So thank you so much for watching and comment down below if you got one too. Maybe what you got, what you liked, what you didn't. And uh, if you were hoping for one, I'm hoping they do it again because this was pretty awesome and I'm super excited to get my December box. Thanks so much for watching and uh, bye.